My name is Abelardo Cruz. I'm the head of a company named GEM and MHC Group. We're based out of Houston. And we're going to talk about marketing math. Marketing math sounds a bit technical and it sounds like something I need to study like physics, like arithmetics, like algebra, but it's not. It has formulas, it has definitions and distinctions, but it's more about common sense. Let's go about marketing first. Marketing is going appro and approaching a market where companies are selling goods, services, and people like you and I are trying to choose when to buy, what to buy, or when not to buy. What I already have, I don't need, and maybe I want it, but perhaps it's not the proper time to buy. Those efforts, companies trying to sell or trying to have people buy, is what we typically call marketing. We as individuals need to make those choices. But if I'm on the marketing side, I need to know what efforts are needed to be able to sell something, to be able to have people buy it. That's when I need to see if the investment has a proper return. That's what ROI means, return on investment. Also, if there's many transactions when individuals buy a product or service, I need to dimension the cost of each and every one of those transactions against the overall investment of that marketing effort. That's cost per transaction. So there's different fundamental distinctions or terms. At the end of the day, what's the effort? What's the return? Does it make sense? That's what marketing math is about.